All right, Erica, a South Florida teacher getting a lesson in the law after she's accused of putting her hands on a kindergartner. Vanessa Medina is live in Margate with these details. Vanessa. That teacher is accused of child abuse, and now the Broward County School Board says it's investigating. Khadijah Muhammad, a kindergarten teacher at Margate Elementary School, in trouble, accused of child abuse. She was arrested last week, and parents at the school early Monday morning say they had no idea. My reaction is I'm very surprised because my daughter right now is in kindergarten, but that's not her teacher, thank God. Um, but that's very surprising to hear this from our school. Very surprised and not to be notified by it. Mohammed is accused of roughing up a five year old kindergartner in the school's hallway before school started. The kindergartner, according to the report, was sitting down on the ground and threw a paper airplane at another student. The encounter caught on surveillance video, and according to the arrest report, it shows Mohammed lift him off of the ground by his arms, twist his arms, and grabbed him by the back of his shirt while shoving him across the hallway. Nicole Sieb's child is in kindergarten. Yeah, it's very shocking. I'm, I'm surprised, to be honest. I, it's, it's alarming, but, you know, they handled it well, I'm assuming. You know, took care of what they needed to. I, I didn't even know anything. That's, that's a little alarming. The report goes on to say she ripped the jacket off his back and continuously grabbed the student by his arms, wrists, shirt, and jacket. Police say it lasted two minutes and at no point she asked for help from other faculty that were also in the hallway. The report goes on to say that the video shows Muhammad grab him around his neck and slam him to the ground. I don't definitely not agree with that or condone that. I have a five year old daughter. I mean, if that happened to me, I'd be in there. I'd be in there uh, at once some answers. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's not something to play around with. These are little kids, and I'm, I'm getting tired of all this, this school stuff going down down here. I really am, and I really feel bad for these these students and their parents, and uh, these teachers need to be, they need to be uh, held accountable. So the Broward County School Board releasing this statement that reads in part, the school is working closely with law enforcement regarding the situation and the teacher involved has been reassigned away from students and the school pending the outcome of the case. Now we have heard from many teachers who go to school here in defense of Mrs. Muhammad saying that she is a kind teacher. She has uh, experience with ESC students. She knows and has been working here for quite some time and she's not only a veteran, but they say she is a kind woman so they're hoping once all of the facts come out with this case she will be exonerated reporting live in margate vanessa medina seven news